Hi, thank you for tuning in. In this recording, I am guided to just share this. And um, there's a place of acceptance in being a twin flame. And when you accept the fact that you are indeed on this path, indeed a twin or whatever it is you want to call it, um, but you're connected to the one that you say is a twin flame of yours, there comes a level of acceptance. And this comes with one, accepting yourself, you know, because there does come times on this path where you and I, we have all been like, this is full of BS and no, <laughs> I am not doing this. But there also comes a time of self-acceptance, self-accept- um, soul acceptance and recognizing the connection and just being real with yourself. And um, no matter what anybody says, there's going to be people that, oh, no, this is this cannot be. This is not true. This is not right. And that's their truth, okay? And stick and let them know, like, or just you know that that's their truth. And my truth is different because it's it's a feeling that you absolutely cannot ignore. And it is a feeling. It's not something that you're making up. It's a, okay, let me figure out what this is. And you have self-explored, you have um, looked at many things, and you have seen all the signs, and, you know, it's like, all right, all right already. Like, I fully accept this. And, you know, what? what is it that I need to know right now about the one that I am connected to? What is their soul trying to tell me? And, you know, and and listen, see what the signs are when you go to bed, what's, you know, what's coming, what is it showing you about your connection to this one? And sit with that and see, see what you're shown. Um, Dreams are big for me. I don't know about for you, but I get a lot of messages through my dreams. And uh, right before I go to bed, I I meditate and I have many visions. So this is a great time to tune in, tap in, turn on and receive what it is that you need to receive. And not always, it's not always going to be about your twin. And that's okay. Like it doesn't need to be um, because sometimes you do need to just focus on you. But when the twin does come up, um, you know, accept it because it can be very, um, electrifying, buzzing, like, Ooh, okay. This is a lot of information for me to digest. And it takes some time for you to integrate it and take the time for yourself when you do need to integrate it. So there's the acceptance and the integration part, like, okay, this is it. And uh, this one needs love. So uh, this month I am covering, as you guys know, the Sacred Heart. And the Sacred Heart is a connection. It's a it's a flame. Or it's a intensive that activates these codes within. And I want to share a little bit about that because I am, after this video, I'm going to, or this recording, I'm going to, be recording my channeling for that but um and it's private so if you want to be on that email me and i'll send you more information so anyways pink energy pink okay the vibration of pink it is so vital it it is so beautiful and that's what i what i what comes out when i'm doing my light language is this like beautiful pink energy if you guys could see energy it's it's pink most of the time sometimes it could be other colors but for the sacred heart and um what you you know would 
maybe try uh, to send to your beloved is like a pink energy or gold energy this pink and golden essence the gold energy is a christ energy it's the christ energy that we have that's flowing within us and your beloved has that too and, and it's a connection that we all have as um, brothers and sisters on this path and it's beautiful you know, we all have the ability to tap into this and to send that loving vibration to your beloved. And so anyways, in this um, <clears throat> light language transmission that will be coming through, it's going to be a small one, and um, but it's powerful. So just really tune into the vibration of pink, that pink loving it's the high heart of the rose ray um the sisterhood of the rose ray the divine mother um that wants to work with all of us the the christ energy that was within all of us um and just really tap into that And take a deep breath and connecting with that vibration of your beloved. Really accepting that, you know, without a, sometimes there could be desperation hooked in there and, you know, let that just kind of slide or the anxiety of the union. When is this happening? You know, I need this now. Just breathe because it's here. And it's going to happen in divine timing. And breathe in. And breathe in. divine feminine to speak to our masculine and receive the energy from your masculine now Take a deep breath in and just allow that to penetrate and sending that love vibration to your beloved, to yourself. <sighs> and if you are guided to reach out to me, please do. And um, I have all my information th below. Peace. May peace flow to you and through you and don't be scared to share who you are there's power and truth and love blessings